Welcome back, everybody, to more Elix 2. And I'm not sure what we're actually doing right now. Um, I'm doing so much Tavar stuff. Okay, these are the main missions. Should I do any of this? Um, Plague of Rats. Oh, right, right. Bunch of hungry mass rats. Yeah, great. Five of them. Well, I am stronger than the last time we did that, so... Oh, they're in there. Well, that's unfortunate. I guess it's going to basically be the same. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before we do that. Um, before we do that. Let's... Uh, where, which building had the jetpack thing to this? This have it. Socketing bench. Uh, ammo press. Ranged weapons. Yeah, I think it's the other building. Oh, is this my personal bed? I assume so. Ish. Ah, no, here we go. Okay, so we've got. Oh, just just enough money. Wait, before I do that, was I going to... Ah. Yeah, I was going to do one of these, wasn't I? Do I have a meta metabolism trainer? Probably. Uh, extra hit points would be kind of nice. Resistance would, of course, be nice as well. Yeah, so we do have enough money for uh, either the potions or the food. Mm. 50% more effective food. So let's take... Fried poultry. For example, so that would probably be, I mean, it'd either be roughly 50, 55 health, or it would have a longer duration. I'm not quite sure which, whether the amount or the regeneration, the amount or the duration is increased from that, um, uh, Actually, you know what? We can probably just uh, test it out. Let's do a save. And... Oh, no, I need to go to the metabolism. Right. I need to go to the metabolism. You know what? Never mind. Let's just do the jetpack for now. Maneuvering boosters um, uh, allow you to move sideways in midair. Okay. Sprint boosters. You can fly faster thanks to... Sprint boosters. You can fly faster. Thanks to sprint boosters. Okay. Additional tank is really nice. Increased fuel capacity. And then the retro rockets that uh, basically break your fall. You can mount one, you can mount two, you can mount three, and you can mount four. So I guess you have to keep replacing the retro rockets after they're fired. And you can also float for a time. Yeah, all this stuff was basically default in the first game. Um, I mean, the faster speed is nice, but I think I'm going to actually go for the additional tank first. And there goes all my money. You can increase your fuel capacity. Do you really want to increase fuel capacity? Uh, yes. Oh, you can increase it all the way to 50? How much of a difference does this actually make? Oh. So it's not really going to be that great until we get... No, it's... It's not... 
bad. Yeah, it's definitely not bad. Okay. I don't know how much of a difference that really makes, but it's definitely going to make a big difference once we get it, like, leveled all the way up. I, and can I actually do it more than... Like... Oh, we have... Oh, okay. Yeah, we can actually increase this all the way to five. Nice. So we just need to collect more fuel. Okay, let's see what kind of effect that had. I mean... Shit! Ow, there goes my legs. <laughs> Well, he will, uh, leave that off, I guess. Okay, well, that makes some difference. Commander, current understanding of invader technology insufficient. Yeah, we definitely need yeah. to learn more. I want to know a lot more before we make a move. But are they that advanced? We need info on how they operate and how they think. We need a better assessment of their whole situation. Their technology will help. Invader technology deployed in the vicinity of the Bastion. Recommend scan. You already looked around? Great work, little guy. Immediate departure possible. Awaiting orders. Ah. Hmm. Okay. Sure. Let's go do that. Let's do this. You can take me to the Skyon's tech. Acknowledged. Follow, Commander. You gonna teleport me there? Nice. Alien technology located nearby. Due north. Okay. And let's see what we find. Stand by. Hmm. It's time. It's time. Contact. Scene. Looks like alien agitators guarding something. Okay. We're probably gonna have to fight some. My head. Books. Yeah, no, my head's not good. Oh, that looks Damn like some infection. sort of. If I don't get a handle. Oh, on those guys it, look. That like thing trouble. is going to happen to me. They definitely. What the heck is that? It's like a. Pterodactyl? Oh, are they shooting at it? Nice. Get in there and kill them. It's a chance while we have them. Uh, I'm taking damage, boys. Oh boy. Get off my buddy. Okay, well, we're not doing that right now. I mean, while they were distracted by the pterodactyl thing, 
thing is going to happen to me. While they were distracted by that, he was fine, but after that, not so much. We gotta get stronger. Poor crony got taken out by those jerks. Immediate offensive deployment recommended. I'm on it. What? what are you talking about? Oh, there's there's an enemy right there. Who are you? Traveling merchant. Oh, okay. Don't suppose you guys could help me out over here, eh? Think so. Okay. You with me, crony? Or did you did I leave you behind up there? You and me, dude, we're gonna take out some mass rats. One. Nice, nice. Let's just try to keep them coming one at a time. Hey, little guy. Can you tell me why people built these glass domes? Analyzing material composition. Analyzing atmospheric conditions. <laughs> Analysis complete. 98% accuracy. Formulating answer. Assuming structures airtight. Prevailing atmospheric conditions and elevated CO2 content indicate structures used to accelerate growth process of plants. Answer complete. Oh, well, thank you very much. Interesting. <coughs> Pardon me. Where do the other rats get off to? Um, why can't I pick that up? Okay. Sure. By the other side. Maybe. Come on, mass. Ugh. Keep running away. I saw something else here. Anything else of interest in this? Yeah, come here. Come here. Medium. Okay, never mind. Well, they're like 
quite a bit further away, I didn't realize. Don't see anything else of particular interest, so let's go get this one. Imagine these things crawling into bed with you for warmth. Oh, 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 that's gross. Okay, do we? How come the the guy disappeared? Hmm. Okay, let's go back here. See if we can find uh, Olaf. the rats no way you did oh oh wow I I can't thank you enough uh, here take this now I can finally head back home thank you you're welcome oh, that is illegal oh, I'm taking moonshine Wait, 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 what's that? A potato. You really need help. I need potatoes, man. What a pleasure. My name is Caleb, your favorite merchant. Buy now while stocks last. Why aren't you trading in the fort? I come from Crater City. The guards don't like that. At least they let me set up out here, though. And how is business going? I don't have many customers, unfortunately. Mostly it's the poor bastards working in the fields. They barely have a shard to spare. And the guards, they buy whatever they need in the fort. As soon as I have enough money, I'm out of here. I'm definitely not looking at a bright future if I stay. What do you have to offer? Here, you'll find goods from all around the world. And the prices are the best part. You know why? You're offering a discount. Come on, you trying to ruin me? I offer my stuff at regular market prices. No discount, no bonus. Nothing at all. I thought the prices were the best part. You misunderstand. The prices stay stable. That's their advantage. I'm not cheating anyone. I mean, I can't just give you special treatment. I have to be a complete idiot to do that. Do I look like an idiot? Well... You now you're the third person to answer like that? I need to stop asking the question. Whatever. Now I'm really off track. If you want to take a look at my wares, let me know. Show me what you've you got. you really want an answer to that question? Oh. A weapon with substantially better stats, and it, can, it has a uh, empty socket. It can be upgraded to an enhanced sword. Interesting. Unfortunately, my strength and dexterity are nowhere near good enough for that. Um, how much have I got in the way of? Uh, ammo. Yeah, still quite a bit. I'm just using it as a thing. Here, you can take that and those. And, oh, got lots of claws. Take some of those. Oops. That. A one piece of leather. I don't think it would be a great idea to sell that, though. 
have a horn. I wonder if I can use these for smithing, uh, or if I should just sell them, the trophies. They're not worth a ton. I don't have a lot of them, so whatever for now. Oh yeah, I am and One broke. last thing before you go. Come and visit when you're back in the area. I have way more need for your shards than those spoiled brats up at the fort. See you around. The funny thing is, he just gave me shards. Rack a scan. Yeah, I can't do that. Stolen valuables. All oh, right, I should probably check on Thorhild. See if um, Lass has got the stuff to her. Where is she at? March across that field. Yes, ma'am. Last made you the work tools. Did it cause any problems? You'll probably mark it down against your name in the future. Typical. Anything else? I had to decide how many work tools he should make. That blockhead should just do his job. But good. I can stop worrying about it now. There were a few expenses. There were a few expenses. Here I am with all these problems and you come talking about expenses. There. Now listen to me. My workers are running 20 away. 20 shards. These people suck. And while I'm trying to fix their mistakes for them, they take the rest of the day off. You just let them go like that? What do you take me for? I was distracted for a split second. That's all it took for them to make a break for it. Just now, when the seedlings need the most attention. You need to get them back. No discussion. I can't do it myself. I need to make sure the seedlings don't wither away. Where would your workers hide? If only I knew. They couldn't have gotten very far. I'm guessing they're in the fort. Eating, drinking. They want nothing more in life. Sounds good to me. Eat, drink, burp. Uh, okay, that's yet another thing. Uh, they didn't really give me a direction, so we'll just ask around, shall we? I don't want to ask him. You need something? Yeah. Keep walking. Okay. Totally not helpful. It's time we took better care of Caracas. Densely populated area detected. Deactivating enemy sensors. Um, well, we'll keep asking. Oh, of course, you did say eating and drinking, right? So. Simply won't be coming back. I can't him. right now. Ugh, of course you can. Party took the whole troop. This must be a joke. What is it with the guys around here always hitting on every woman they see? A better kept hitting. I don't believe that. That's got to be the craziest thing I've ever heard. Um. I heard they all die. I guess I can go back to Chloe's. How about a drink first? Unfortunately, people are not overly helpful.
Hi, right, how's it going, Ivan? Okay, good talk. Good talk. See, you all got your masks on already. That's good. Hello. A few things oh. you gotta know before we get started. Come on, come closer. Don't make an old man holler. That's better. Right. Now listen up. We're about to head down into the mine. You'll need something to eat, sleep, fight with, and take the edge off. Last one's optional, I guess. Tools are already down there. And just don't forget, the mine's chock full of gas. So change your filters out often, okay? All right. Let's go, then. Good luck, guys. Hey, Scrappy. Can I... Ah, you know what? They're going down to the mine. Whatever. Good luck, guys. Shit pay, shit work, shit life. Yeah, you're a cultivator. Just don't think about it. Hey. Thanks, Chloe. Appreciate it. Cultivator. I'm telling you, next chance I get, I'm quitting. Okay. Ah, the old bitch is in a mood again. Hmm. Okay, she doesn't have any information. I don't understand anything about working here, but nobody wants to help you either. Well, there are a lot of. Man, I'm still not done with my drink. Come back later, man. <laughs> it's still... You've been drinking for like three days, man. Uh, there are a lot of cultivators here, but they're not. There's my way, and there's the wrong way. I don't give a damn. Oh, there's a rake uh, right there. Just forget it. You take his weapon. Um, I feel sorry for. Yeah, I don't know. Better be quiet. They don't really want to talk. Had to happen. No point dwelling on it. Sometimes I wish the Duke was back. Here's some advice. If you find any other job than this one, take it. That wow, was they really long. do not like really working annoying. in the fields. Anyone who says so is a damn idiot. Holy shit. Okay, well. That didn't work out quite as planned. They do have the, the target here, though. Hmm. Anybody hiding around back or anything? It's really too late for that now. What do I like here? Don't ask me what this is about. Mm, that would be a big fat no. Oh, this place only has one entrance, though. Not now, I'm busy. There's my way, and there's the wrong I'm busy getting drunk, man. I'd have a post of different. Hey, there isn't no there we really isn't Should another be. one you take that over you like do you kind of know anything nope nothing well you think so I think you're full of shit I don't believe it sure Nothing is safe these days. How can you say Butch? that? Whatever. In the area, too. You're thirsty, aren't you? Shouldn't you be looking after the seedlings? I can wait. Thorhill doesn't see it that way. And that old lady should pay us some real money. We're not screwing around for the hell of it. We know a lot's riding on these seedlings. That's why we're busting our asses looking out for them. Just a couple of shards for all that? Shh. Come on, man. What's wrong with these shards? Not enough of them's what's wrong. 
Do anything wrong and the bitch cuts our pay. Why don't you bring it up to her? She doesn't give a shit. Only cares about that green stuff. And always finds something to complain about. Rearing these seedlings ain't easy. Well, maybe for her it is. Work in the field all her damn life. But us? Look at this ragtag bunch. Most of them are from the gutter. That smart ass attitude of hers doesn't help. Tossing a few shards our way is the least she can do. Hmm. Is Thorhild the one who decides how many shards you get? I think so. She's so stingy, I bet she doesn't even change her drawers. Hey, couldn't you talk to her? If you can get her to kick in a few more shards for us, we'll get back to work. Promise. Ow. I'm assuming they won't be coming I was back. going to do the, uh... Party the, like, get your asses back to Apparently work Apparently they're thing, still in Goliath. That's not an option now, sadly. We need along the way. Hey, stop running away. Stop standing in the water. And? Did you find the cultivators? Yep. Yeah. Butch told me they wanted more shards. Ungrateful curs. Is my training worth nothing to them? They don't think much of that either. And they still want more shards? Unacceptable! Surely you can spare a little Alexit. You've no doubt noticed that more seedlings has meant more cultivators. A little soon turns into a great many. But Fenris isn't allocating me more funds. So, I have to make do with the budget I have. You see? My options are limited. Or do you have a solution already? I'm certainly not giving you 2,000 shards. I'll talk to Fenris about payments for the cultivators. I bet he won't cough up a single shard. You'll see. Why would why would he? Why, why would I be able to convince Fenris to give him more money? That's not gonna work out. Oh, we'll see. Fenris will want me to go do a thing, and then... Oh, maybe. Nobody listens to me. It makes me feel really bad. Thorhild says you'll divide up the shards, right? I suppose. Can't say I'm looking forward to it. Everyone feels like they've been shortchanged and wants more. The cultivators, for example. Ah, so that's why you came to see me. And no, I cannot give Thorhild more shards. I'd have to withhold some from the paladins if I did, and Scrappy is already underpaid. Talk to Tylus. If he'd be willing to forego his shares of the shards, I might be able to make something work. Who? Tylus? And why would Tylus agree to this? Guess we'll find out. Uh, is it? I haven't actually talked to you before. You want a healing elixir for your nose. I'll give you two ointments. Now, where did I put them? The last ointment was... No, one moment. Wait, I'll be right back. What? We 
he's got lots of stuff. Look at all this. I have not been in here before. Unfortunately, I can't even steal water. World Heart Specialist Literature? Oh god. Thorhold's records. Observable changes have been taking place in the environment envir environment since the Alps began collecting uh, elix in large volumes. Temperatures have sunk drastically and destroyed the delicate balance of the climate. We're planting our world hearts to counteract these changes. The seedlings require a great deal of time and care to grow into an adult world heart. The seedlings cannot survive on their own when they are first uh, planted and must be regularly supplied with mana. Only a few survive the mana treatment, so it's important to plant enough cut enough cuttings. On average, the seedlings need about six months until they're strong enough to be carried out into the world. At this stage, they start to revert to revert the elix in their surroundings. During this stage of further growth, special braces need to be made for them to help stabilize them and allow them to spread out without restriction. Once this phase is complete, the world hearts can be used for terraforming. Caring for an adult world heart involves several steps. They need to be cleaned regularly, especially along the gaps. Impurities can be scraped out. If the world heart is damaged during this process, the affected area must be washed out with mana and then dried. Huh. Oops. Oh my goodness, I have a light. I have a light. I have a magical light. Botany book. Can I take that too? Come on, botany book. Yeah. Resistance of local flora. In addition to the regeneration of life force and astral reserves, further temporary side effects can be achieved by consuming certain plants and foods. Thorn Blossom raises the body's defenses against bleeding effects. Chili protects from colds, uh, also helpful for frostbite. Frost Thorn reduces the effect of burns. Honey reduces resistance to poison, or sorry, raises resistance to poison. Garlic Many uses reduces damage from radiation. Black Lotus further investigation required. Cool. Helpful. I don't know what he's doing over there. Uh, I'll take a small healing potion. Thank you. And apparently I can't take that plant. Hey. Hey, come over here. But, what you want? How to you? Got anything to trade? Sure. I'm sure you've got something special to show me. That's how these deals work, right? Oh, I'm excited to see what you've come here with. So. Let's talk Elix. Is that what you've got? You want Elix? You can have it. Exchange Elix, one. And you use this. Exchange Iron Ore. How about a lockpick? Exchange lockpick. Uh, how does a beer sound? Don't have anything more exciting right now. It's as good as I can offer. Mm, I'll do Elix. Let's do one and see what happens. If that's what you want, then yeah, I've got Elix. That's what I want to hear. There are very few more exquisite things in life. I'm impressed. You know how to appeal to my good taste. I do have something for you, though. It's pretty special. It's a little heavy, but you're going to like it. Yeah, but you can't give this to me. Of course I can. Finding a buyer would have been tricky anyway. But I heard gold is used for electronics. That's got to be useful to you, right? It's more of a kind of thing for the clerics. 
Oh, yeah. Speaking of which, there's this cleric woman, Vivian. She'll give you a good price, guaranteed. Don't go making any stupid deals, though. Sell it properly. Thousand shards, minimum. Wow. Really? Why didn't you just sell it yourself? Why didn't you sell the ingot to the clerics yourself? Simple logistics. These long journeys don't make great business sense. The return doesn't justify the risk, especially the risk to my life. Besides, I'm needed here. That's worth more than any deal. Can we do business again? Can we do business again soon? Not just yet. I need some time. Relax, though. We're good. You'll see me again. We'll be doing business again in no time. Oh, you actually are leaving now. Okay. Well, at least that wasn't a complete loss. So I got some kind of gold bar. That even yeah, oh, there it is. Cannot be sold. It's a mission item. Gold bar was given to me by a guy named Hank for trading. If what he says is right, it should be very valuable. Do we have a? Um, uh, yeah, does this lead me somewhere? Oh, it does. Vivian. Okay. I mean, we've been part of the way up there. That's not too far, really. Okay, cool. Are you ready yet, dude? No, he's just... Him around. Okay, well, we will uh, just rob him then, I guess. Don't want trouble? It quits. Damn thief! Oh no. That's unfortunate. Did that he. I did not notice that guy. Okay. Again? Walking upright's hard for you, huh? Who is who's saying that? Ooh, small bag of luck. There. Yeah. How about this? Mining for dummies. Step one, make sure to bring the right tools unless you're planning on stripping the rock with your bare hands. Step two, don't wander around aimlessly. We'll tell you where to search. See the appendix for details. Step three, hit a vein. Make sure nobody's nearby. A successful prospector never shares their, shares their bounty. Jealousy is a hazard in our line of work. Locations, iron. Keep your eyes peeled for iron veins in caves and tunnel systems. Make sure your helmet is sitting right before you start mining. Don't come complaining to us if you forget. Get hit in the noggin by fallen rocks. Sulfur. Make sure you have an ample ample water supply before taking off in, such, in search of sulfur. It's mainly found in very hot areas like lava flows. If you'd prefer to avoid danger, you can certainly... Sh you can try certain shore areas. Uh, Amosite. Got your flippers? Then you don't won't need any problems, won't have any problems finding Amosite. Named after the explorer Amadeus. This metal is often found near rivers. Alexit. Down to your last dime, then just go find yourself an Alexit vein and kiss your worries goodbye. The only problem is that these veins are usually heavily guarded. Prepare for a scuffle with reavers or other scallywags. Uh, great word. Alexit veins are known to be near c converters. Gold, precious material, pre precious metal. To this day, nobody really knows why it's often found near standing bodies of water. The author assumes you probably don't care. Iridium. Got a jetpack? Then you're one of the lucky few who are able to mine iridium. But it's not going to be easy. You'll find this metal in hard to reach places like cliff walls. Make sure you're wearing a pair of decent a decent pair of shoes, otherwise you'll risk ending up like this metal's namesake. The cleric 
Harold, who slipped and fell to his death. Don't be a Harold. <laughs> right. And oh, I can just open that. Nice. And gold plate and Alexa. Oh, a lot of Alexa. Well, okay. Okay, dude, are you... Are we talking or what? What do you want? Can't you see I'm busy? You were gonna give me some sort of ointment. I was? How impertinent of me to be so... presumptuous. Ointments need preparation. Consideration. Wait, what do you actually want? You know I can't give you any work. I already have an assistant. And I can't offer any training. Only my apprentice is allowed that honor. I don't see an apprentice. Well, no. The last one left. He was completely incompetent. So the position is free? By no means. So you found another? That is not what I said. Um, okay. We're going around in circles. We're going around in circles. Look, I just can't say right now. Sorry, but I must be going. I hope everything is crystal clear. Mm, like mud. Don't make me steal more stuff from you, man. Ooh, like a warrior potion. Ah, you're looking this way. He just won't give up. No, what is it he won't. Now? I need a few shards for the cultivators. Could you spare any? Listen here, young man. You're getting rather presumptuous. It's urgent. Thorhill's workers are running away. Okay, well, in that case, ask my assistant. If anyone around here could spare some, it's that scoundrel Rake, not me. Okay, now that is somebody I know. I'm pretty tired of you lot passing the buck all the time. Oh, so I'm not the only one you've asked. Well, don't expect me to be any different from the others. I do the work of two people and rarely catch a break. This is too much. Even my patience has its limits. Allow me to refer you to Special Regulation A38. The property of an alchemist must not be misappropriated. And that includes my Alexit. Okay, but how about it? I've just told you, bring it up with my assistant. You know, I thought motivating him with shards was a good idea, but it's had the opposite effect. It does mean, however, he's got shards to spare. You won't like me asking. Of course. You'll need to be very persuasive. I'd be glad to see the back of him. Anyway, head to the tavern. No doubt he'll be holed up there. Now, if you'll please excuse me. Right, okay. Well, now we actually know a thing. Uh, no, I don't want to do that one. That? Yes. Take some shortcuts, probably end up killing myself. Why would he do that? I he was Man, I'm still not done with my drink. Then drink faster. We have to talk. Oh yeah? Spit it out. The cultivators want more shards. No shards, no work. 
Ah, I understand completely. Oh, wait. No, that's bullshit. What's it got to do with me? You're supposed to give up part of your pay for them. <laughs> Sounds real appealing. Bet Tyler's put that dumbass idea in your head, huh? Does it matter? Will you share or not? Man, they really pull the wool over your eyes, huh? Listen, I have a better idea. If you're gonna tell me to find someone else, forget it. <laughs> Been running around like a headless rat, huh? No sweat, man. Tell you what, take this Alexit. Just a little proof that you'll like my solution. Don't wanna blow my own trumpet, but I'm pretty well known for coming up with solutions to tough problems. Those idiots should have sent you to me right away. Listen up, man. Meet me here tomorrow. Gotta call in a few favors. Then you'll get what the cultivators want, alright? But first, I need some food to get the gray matter going. Well, maybe just a drink. Okay, great. It's really too late for that now. I don't believe it. That's gotta be the craziest thing I've ever exactly. heard. Did you hear that they escaped? I don't know the guy. I don't believe it. Oh. Hmm. I can't remember what Ivan even wants from me. Um. Really? Need to figure out a way to restrict uh, oh. his restrictions. Okay. What about this? Oh shit! I guess I could give that a go. To eat something though. Oh, we got a lot of stuff. Do we have any? Fires around here where I can do some cooking. There's an enemy down there. See any fires anywhere? Oh, there's one. Yeah, there's definitely something going on over here. Loot, nice. Free loot. Now you guys are doing a lot of stuff. Unfortunately, I'm losing XP. It could be for me. But I am getting some free. Some free um, loot. Where did that whole fire pit get off to? Ah, there we go. And let's cook up the rats. And... This all does the same when cooked. I need, I need one of those, um, like, not a, not a campfire, but a, um, like an oven kind of thing. I'll be able to make something else there. How are my shards doing? Oh yeah, I can actually, I uh, get... I could get good eater or stronger potions. We have a metabolism trainer. Social. Metabolism trainer, really? Huh. Oh. 
Oops. Doorman does um, melee weapons and heavy weapons. We've got gunsmithing. Do we really not have a fast travel point here? Damn it. Ah, well, that sucks. I don't actually have anything. Anyway, okay. Whatever. Let's go over here. We've got mass rafts. Or blood claws. <laughs> so nice that it has the, uh, Unlooted things highlighted for you on the minimap. Okay. What do we got going on here? Hey, dude. Oh, oh boy. Oh. Ow. Oh, and I'm poisoned. Poison though. Hey, you're down. Oh, he's doing the whole uh, shield thing too. Look at you go. Serious poisoning. I actually get this guy, apparently. Okay. Oh. Is that it? No, no. Definitely more. Yeah, this guy right there. This looks incredibly welcoming. So there's at least one guy left, right? No, there's another guy right there. Enough. Come on down here. Excellent. Excellent. Oh, nice. He's down. Yeah! <laughs> 
You got kind of murderized there, bud. Man. Inch. Okay, we got more crap down here. People. Crap people. To a trade. Oh. Trade with your comrades and suffer. But above all, you That's the radio. It'll help everyone in the end. This is her. What's down here? I see a dead body. Ugh, what a mess. Now time for a little music. You're listening to her. Grenade blueprint. Uh, we got some gold ore, goblet, money, and stolen valuables as a mission item. To all you lonely wanderers out there, stick to the paths. Don't go into the forests unless you really have to. Stay away from the unknown ruins and caves. Okay, I think that's that. This is Herbert, broadcasting from the Orbit. Hey, jerk. I took this from the Reavers. You? How the hell did you manage that? Instead of asking questions, how about you just pay me? Don't forget who you're talking to. Here, take this. That's it? For you, that's it. I don't like you playing hero even though I warned you off. If they'd killed you, they would have known we were onto them. So don't think I like what you did. I know what I'm doing. So do I. Wait a minute. I think I see an opportunity here. Oh yeah? All of a sudden? What makes you think I'd still be interested? Eh, the situation is different now. You'd be acting directly on my behalf. Listen to me, and you'll have so many shards you won't know where to spend them. Fine. What's your idea? You've already proven that you can handle yourself against a couple of Reavers. But what about something... bigger? Could you take that on? Giant Reavers? Giant Reavers. Sure, no problem. Smartass, I'm talking about a troll. That beast has three of our best warriors on its conscience. I was sure they'd be able to get rid of it. So I need someone who's got the brawn and the brains to tackle this job. About that troll. Why don't your hunters take care of it? Those idiots? <sighs> live and let live, my ass. Astrid says we provoked the fucking thing, and now it's our fault it's causing trouble. But what are we supposed to do, huh? Just sit and watch until it gets past the gates? Then we'll have the cultivators on our asses, too. So I talked to Fenris about it and decided to send out a few warriors. 
That was a mistake, as it turns out. No, no, you've got to act, even if it means you might fail. The real mistake would be doing nothing at all. Where can I find the troll? Like I said, that beast is getting dangerously close. Try northwest of the seedling fields. If you want to be absolutely sure, go see Astrid. I'm sure she'll know more about it. You might even convince her to go out on the hunt with you. I would be nice. I'll take care of it. And it's not going to be a walk in the park. If you don't take this seriously, you might as well draw up your will now. But what am I saying? I'm sure you know what to do. Go slaughter that beast. Yeah. My buddy. Alright guys, that's it for this episode. Thanks for joining me. We'll see you next time.